everyone, welcome to my first ever YouTube video, my first haul. Um, today I'm going to be doing a baby boy and young girls Primark haul. Um, everything came to a total of £31 and I got quite a lot for that. So I'm really pleased with what I bought and hopefully you'll see some things that you like and might want to uh, try and pick up for your kids. So I hope that you enjoy. Okay, so I thought I would start off with the baby boy section. Um, Jackson is eight months old, but everything that I've bought for him is like 12 to 18 months because he is a total beefcake. He's always been really big. So um, all his summer clothes are actually for 12 to 18 months. Um, but Primark does actually run quite small, I would say, for um, babies and kid sizes. So just bear that in mind, maybe if you're shopping there and you haven't really bought for your kids there before. Um, but Primark was so so busy it was crazy um everyone from coming out of lockdown I think everyone's like number one place to go has been Primark so it was crazy there was lots of mums like elbowing each other out of the way to get to things this is what I could see that I liked <laughs> there was probably a lot more um but I'll start off mostly I was needing t-shirts and shorts for summer for the kids um so I got first of all I got this t-shirt, I've still got the tags on actually, I should maybe take them off, <laughs> um, I got this t-shirt for £1, I think all the t-shirts were £1.30, so total bargain, and it just says be kind, and it's in the lovely brown colour that everyone's like crazy about, all the neutrals just now, so I thought it would be really smart, um, so I got him that, it's not the most summery thing, but it's still a nice casual t-shirt. So I'm still like totally obsessed with the yellow mustard colour that everyone was crazy about last year. Um, so I got him this t-shirt, it says, you and me, we are family. I thought it was a really nice sort of sunshiny colour for summer. Um, the third t-shirt we got, this was actually Cameron's choice, which I thought was pretty cool. Um, it says, hold on till I get this label off. Um, it says, awesome like my mama. And it's this really nice sort of like green colour, like deep green. And I love this colour on Jackson. He like really suits it. So I think I think this will be a nice little outfit for him. He also got, I can't believe how big these look. I can't believe he's going to be wearing these soon. But um, there's these little white like chino shorts. And Cameron thought that these would pair really nicely together with the white writing. I don't know if I can hold this up neatly enough for you to see. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think that that'll be really cute. So, so I like that one. And then he's got some other little, just like t-shirts and like soft shorts, like really casual, like all the shorts as well here are £1.30. The only thing that was more expensive here was these white shorts that I just showed you and they were £4. Um, everything else of Jackson's is £1.30. So total bargain. Um, I got this smile today t-shirt and I got these little shorts to go with them again mustard yellow they get a little bit of a theme with me um and then this little vest he doesn't have any vest so I thought he'd look so cute with his little he's got such like gorgeous little like chubby baby arms I thought he'd look so cute in a little vest so he's got this little one it's got little like elephants and giraffes and things on it so that will be cute. And the last little set for Jackson is this little, this is actually an outfit that's really similar to one that Cameron wears in summer. So I thought they'd look really cute matching together. So it's this little uh, Surf the Waves white t-shirt. I love white in summer. It's like so nice, like just keeps you cool, doesn't it? So um, I got these little red shorts, little dinosaur on them look really really bright on the camera but they're just like a nice red in person and this is totally like an outfit that Cameron wears so the boys are going to be looking cool matching I'll have to get them some shades to wear together too <laughs> but um that's it for the boys thing so I'll go and get the little girl stuff okay so for the little girl stuff Bella is um she's going to be two in July but um I'm starting to buy sort of like age two to three clothes for her and it's really sad actually because I look at the little baby girl section and I just can't believe that Bella can't wear any of those things anymore. So this is from the sort of um, little girls area, it's not the baby girls. Um, 
but I did see really cute things when I looked over so I would definitely say it's worth having a look if your little girl's younger than mine but I'll start off with this was my favorite I love this dress it's so cute it's like a little smock style dress and I've already tried it on her it's so cute and it's got like all these little flowers I think it's really sweet, just a nice little light dress. I would love it if it would fit me. I find that all the time when I'm shopping for my little girl. I'm always like, I would absolutely love this in adult size. Um, another dress. This one is like really bright in person. I don't know how much it shows up on the camera, but it's just a cute little, again, flowery light dress, like something nice to throw on for her to play in the garden all the time. It gets really hot here in Essex in summer. I was so shocked when I moved from Scotland. It was like in the 30s all the time and I really didn't handle it well. So I'll need a new summer wardrobe for me too because the last two summers I've been heavily pregnant and I literally only have maternity clothes for summer. So I'm gonna have to get like a Primark trip for me too soon. Um, this was the first t-shirt. Let me take off the label too. This was the first t-shirt I saw and I absolutely loved it because Part of the reason why I like this mustard yellow colour so much is because Bella like really really suits it. She's got like lovely sort of like auburn coloured hair and she just like really suits this colour. She's got like big brown eyes as well. So she, I don't know, this colour just seems to pop really well on her and it says beautiful and that's what Bella means. So I think that that's a really nice like totally suits Bella top. Um, and then another t-shirt that I got Bella was this little like just pink top and it has again i should have done all these labels first i'm so sorry um you got this little pink it's like cerise pink it's actually brighter in person from what i can see on the camera and it's just got like a little pocket with these little flowers on it and it's actually really similar to a top i used to have so i thought it was cute um and then the last thing for bella this one was more oh i should say for the t-shirts i think bella's t-shirts were yeah, her t-shirts were £1.80, Jackson's were all £1.30, so the little girl's bit is a little bit more expensive, but still super cheap. And then the last thing that I got were these shorts for £4.50, so the most expensive thing. It's just these little denim shorts for Bella to wear, and she doesn't have any denim shorts, just some comfy ones, so I thought this would be, this would be cute, me and her can match as well. And I thought it would look super cute with this top, I think. I think this sort of yellow and denim goes really nice together but yeah that is everything that's all that I got and it literally that was so much for 31 pounds because I find that when you've got two kids especially like you've just got to buy new wardrobes for them all the time um it's, <laughs> it actually ends up costing quite a lot so as much as I love sort of shopping other places for baby things I think that Primark is really good for just getting a load of sort of staples in so that you don't spend a fortune every like three months that your kid needs new clothes um but yeah so hopefully you saw some things maybe got some ideas for your kids maybe saw something that you think would suit them and hopefully you'll get a trip into Primark and it won't be as crazy and busy as it was for me so you won't have to fight everyone to get what you want um, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I really am striving to sort of make the quality of my videos better. I will be getting some better equipment and hopefully with practice I'll not be, you know, such an amateur. <laughs> um, but thank you so much. Bye guys. Have a lovely day.